Chef Miller J.D. Pendleton and Lexi. We're back inside the kitchen because today I'm going to start my crock pot series. So come along for the ride. These are easy crock pot meals that my family has been raised with. They love and they're so simple and that's what this is about. I know she's crying for it. She wants it too. Lexi loves crock pot meals, don't you girl? So anyway, come along for the ride. Talk to us. Tell us all about it. What ingredients do you think I have put in here? Lexi, talk to me. Talk to me. Hello. Tell me hello. He's inside today because it's pouring raining, so please bear with us today because we got Lexi indoors. Okay, so the first thing we're going to start with, of course, is a crock pot. And this one's by Hamilton Beach. I'm not sure how many quarts are. It's probably about a gallon and a quarter or so. All right. Okay, so we're just going to put in just a little bit of olive oil. Well, about two tablespoons would be enough. And here I have fold out four pieces of chicken breast. So we're just going to lay those in here. Whenever I handle chicken, I always wear rubber gloves. I know that sounds a bit much, but I do. There we go. So here I have four pieces of chicken breast that are unfold. And I'm just going to kind of coat that in that olive oil. All right, so we have our chicken in here. Now we're just going to use a little sea salt here. Salt the actual chicken here a bit. A little bit of cracked black pepper. Cream of mushroom soup, okay? You can make your own. You do not have to use the canned stuff. You can even use reduced sodium or even the reduced fat version. That's fine. I usually make my own, but I'm trying to use up the last of my cabinet of food storage. I've replaced all of my food storage with home canned goods. So I now have one cabinet of canned goods left. So you can do this. You know, don't let the food Nazis out there make you feel guilty for whatever you're using. Just use what, what you feel you want to use. Do what you got to do. But I will start making this, and I will have a video that I'll post when I get my video done. I'll post that video right there. I'll put that link right there. And you can go to it, and you can learn how to make your own uh, cream of mushroom soup for canning. Or the even dried cream of something soup recipes. You can get that all over the internet, that recipe. Now to this, I'm going to add three quarters of a cup of heavy whipping cream. There you go. Because I am lactose intolerant, however, I'm also adding some of this lactose-free whole milk. And you can get it in the skim milk as well. But I'm only adding about a, oh, maybe a little over a quarter of a cup of that. And I have to do that because the enzyme in the lactose-free milk here uh, will help with the, me digest the whipping cream, the heavier whipping cream. Yes, that actually does work for me. I don't know if that works for you or if you've ever tried it, but I always milk, mix just a little bit of that uh, enzyme from the lactose-free milk in with my other dairy, and that seems to work for me, okay? Now, I had some mushrooms, and I didn't think they looked very good, but normally, at this stage, I would put in some fresh mushrooms, and I have some dehydrated mushrooms. I guess I could toss some of those in here as well, so if you got dehydrated mushrooms, you've dehydrated. Uh, you can toss, uh, you know, maybe about two or three tables or two or three uh, little handfuls in here as well. All right, so. Okay, we're back. I've already been eating mine and mixed mine with mashed potatoes. Sorry, I forgot to film it. <laughs> so anyway, go ahead and tell me, take a bite and tell me what you think. Mm. Is that good? It's very good. The chicken's very tender and it's very flavorful. Yeah, and we and we put this over mashed potatoes. I'm very good. 
And of course, I just served it here. This is a quick night. We we stayed up till six o'clock in the morning, uh, fall cleaning the house, didn't we? Yep. So Daddy let me take a little first shift nap mm -hmm. uh, while this cooked. That's why I broke out the slow cooker. <laughs> and um, so we're just eating on paper plates and making it simple tonight. Cheers. Even even Stinker over there is tired. She tried to keep up with us, didn't you, Lexi? I just got to. We're drinking a drink from the foundations of creation. Oh. <laughs> The water was here at the beginning. 